Amazing! Gracious! Another person's passport choice, Lori! Yay! Yay! Amazing! Gracious! Another person's passport choice, Lori! Yay! Yay! Hello, what's up guys? My name is Percy and I'm the Guinness World Record holder for the largest collection of fast food toys. Yeah, baby. How you doing, guys? Uh, so we're here once again to tell you another amazing and stupendous and awe-inspiring Percy's fast food toy story. And boy, have I got a toy for you. <laughs> so the toy for today are from McDonald's, actually a whole. Well, some of them are actually duplicates, so I'm not really uh, sure as to um, uh, what is inside this particular bag. So we've been collecting them and I haven't gotten the chance to actually do a blog about them. So here's our chance to actually go about some of those uh, nifty stuff. Okay, first of all, we have this from Doraemon. Okay, so I think this is a duplicate. <laughs> I'm pretty certain that I already have this. So let's open it anyway. This is from Doraemon when they were actually celebrating Doraemon. Now the reason why I have a couple of these is because whenever you buy a Happy Meal back at the time, I think that was probably two months ago, you get uh, an extra toy. So you basically get two toys for every Happy Meal, uh, Happy Meal that you purchase from McDonald's at that time. Yeah. If I'm not mistaken, I think it's an, in celebration of the anniversary of Doraemon. So let's open it up. First, uh, we have this. Okay, so it's basically this and <laughs> this. It's like a propeller here. So, so we simply put this here, and that's it. So we uh, swirl it around, and as you can see, the balls will actually move uh, from. Oh, okay. <laughs> So, I don't know if you can see them, but the balls are actually moving. Oh, there, yeah, that, I think that's uh, where the direction should be. Okay, so we have Doraemon and Dorami, uh, the siblings, <laughs> the sister of Doraemon. Okay, now let's go for another one. Okay, let's see what this is. Now we'll stop once we have a toy that is not exactly uh, reviewed yet. Okay, so. Let's see if all of these are duplicates. Oh, these are great. This is great. <laughs> okay, so uh, this is from uh, Illumination, the Minions uh, movie. And as you can see here, we have a golden uh, minion. So I guess we'll have to stop. This is a new one. So it is a minion with a scarf and is actually uh, throwing a ball. What is this? What is the connection of the scarf? He's wearing a very winter clothes and is actually throwing, uh, doesn't look like a snowball, <laughs> it looks like a, a bomb or a round uh, ball or something. It looks like a globe. Anyway, uh, judging from the, you know, the, the contortions on the face, he was basically startled as to the kind of snowball that he's about to throw. <laughs> it's not the regular snowballs that it is supposed to throw in a snow fight, but instead it's something diabolical, I suppose. <laughs> and that is why he was a little bit apprehensive to actually throw this to some of his fellow minions. Okay, but what is so exciting about this toy is the fact that it is actually golden. And as you can see, even if it's all colored, uh, gold uh, you can see the hair up there on top of the head <laughs> the neatly combed hair of this particular minion oh, yeah now uh, what is so fun about this uh, particular set is the fact that you can also get the colored version of the toy or the golden uh, version so this is the golden version so I don't know if I have yet uh, gotten this uh, particular uh, design as a colored version. Uh, yeah, I don't think I do remember anything like that. So I'm keeping my fingers crossed that one of these uh, minion uh, toys from McDonald's Happy Meal would, would have a colored version of this specific uh, minion design. And that would be pretty awesome, I guess. Yeah, I think that would be pretty awesome. Okay, so this is great. 
I just love it. And uh, the fact that he's wearing wintry clothes is uh, very appropriate since uh, we are now in the month of September and here in the Philippines we celebrate Christmas as early as September. So if you go to the malls or any household perhaps, you might chance upon uh, music being played in the air. Uh, I mean Christmas music and it is actually sanctioned. So it is legal to actually play Christmas songs as early as September. And yeah, I just love going to the malls uh, on September, or October, November until December because those sweet uh, Christmas music it just fills up the air and puts you in the mood on the joyous uh, season of Christmas and I just love it so this is it I would have loved it oh, or probably this is not a bomb or it's just a Christmas ball yeah I would like to think that this is just a Christmas balls although there are a lot of instances in the minions wherein there really are a lot of diabolical gadgets so I won't be surprised that if it uh, if it is actually a bomb but um, yeah to keep it in the wholesome and safe side I guess this is a snowball that he, uh, this is a Christmas ball that he's about to throw instead of a bomb or instead of a snowball. <laughs> okay, now okay, look at the, 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 the mouth. Isn't that uh, rather hilarious? Okay, so it's a one-eyed minion and we can actually flip it around just to give it a 360 degree turn. And as you can see, uh, the, the minion is colored, uh, colored gold through and through. So even uh, the bottom part is actually colored gold and the top part, yeah. I love the craftsmanship that was made for this uh, particular minion. Uh, <laughs> it definitely looks like a real a golden statue or a, a real golden minion if I may do say so myself. So that is it. So there you have it. For our toy for today, we have the Doraemon, the, what do you call this? Which is actually a duplicate of a previous toy. It's a wind uh, power, uh, yeah, wind power turbine tower. And <laughs> we also got a golden minion as well as this uh, particular capsule to which we will hold the, the golden minion, the precious minion. Just like so. Okay, you can actually open it up and then put it back into this capsule if I can actually open it. <laughs> oh, how do we open it? So that is it. And there you will fit snugly inside our uh, minion capsule. Now I gotta say that this is just an amazing grace. So once again guys, uh, let's try to be thankful to God for all the amazing grace that come to our lives. Beating the form of this awesome minion, uh, yeah, it's a golden minion uh, with uh, winter clothes and some Christmas balls here. And also this capsule as well as this wind power uh, turbine from Doraemon, uh, wherein uh, the sister uh, of Doraemon, uh, Dorami, is actually featured. And of course, Doraemon here. Such a wonderful toy and a great addition to my Percy's Fastboot toy collection. Or basically, guys, let's be thankful to God for every amazing grace. Be they small or big, be they seemingly insignificant or the truly eventful ones, or just about every amazing grace that make our lives a lot more happy and jolly. <laughs> And I thank you guys for always tuning in to Percy's Fast Food Toy Story. Thank you so much to new subscribers. Please do invite your other friends to also subscribe because we still have a lot more. And I mean a lot more Percy's Fast Food Toy Stories of my sleeves. Okay, so until the next one, bye bye for now. And I hope you come back again here in this same channel. It's Percy's Fast Food Toy Story. So until the next one, bye bye. And see you around, guys. And here's our minions.